edu rika through the online researches while i was exploring the various platforms to enhance my node js uh, screen hello everyone tulsi here once again bringing you a new episode where we delve into the journeys of our aspiring learners at edu rika today we are joined by shreya vinayak dalvi who has successfully completed our node.js certification training course let's hear more about her experience in her own words Hi Shreya, thank you so much for joining us here today. Can you please introduce yourself? Yeah, hi Tulsi. First of all, thank you for inviting me on this platform to share my experiences. So, thanks a lot. So, myself Shreya Vinayak Dalvi and I have completed that Node.js training certification from Edureka platform and currently I am working into IT industry and I have 9 plus years of experience uh, into IT. Thank you so much for the introduction. Uh, firstly, I would like to know how did you come to know about Edureka? I discovered Edureka through the online researches while I was exploring the various platforms to enhance my Node.js uh, screen, means uh, Node.js technology. So I found this Edureka website through Google search only. Okay, okay. I'm really glad to know about that. Uh, what are the skills you learned from the Node.js certification training course? Yeah, I have completed the Node.js training certification from Edureka and it was covering most of the topics which are uh, required in my current projects to work on it. So it was covering that Express.js framework, how to build a web servers, how the asynchronous programming is and uh, it started from the scratch means why we required Node.js and what it is and how it came into the picture and why it's required to learn that technology. Plus we learn also microservices and uh, how we can uh, deploy our complete project into github and uh, that docker one uh, platform is there how we can deploy our complete application there plus uh, how to connect with the email server how to connect with the mongodb how node.js application will interact with the mongodb so various topics it got covered in that training course okay, yeah. so what are the best aspects of edureka according to you yeah i went through the various platform but uh, i would like to share my experience that edureka it's giving the what they are saying means what you see is what they are actually right okay. so means uh, what is mentioned on their uh, your website that is you are giving that live classroom training so and uh, you are giving experts instructor and uh, how the that node js course is designed is designed by the expert only and i like your support also which is 24 hours by 7 support so whenever i am in need in at that point i can call you and uh, i can get my queries resolved right plus uh, we are getting two certificates one is the participation certificate and after final project submission we are getting one that nascom which is government approved certification and which is uh, which we which is international level certificate so that's i like the most about edureka and plus we have the flexibility that that our class whatever classroom recordings uh, we will get so we can access that anytime plus course material also we can access anytime anywhere okay and okay. Uh, plus what they mentioned like uh, it's not about the till that time our course is there till the time that only we are engaged uh, in future also we have any query or any upgradation is there in node.js so we can get back to us soon means to edureka and they will get our query resolved so that is the plus point for me yes yes i'm really glad to know that we could give you a best experience so in today's context how crucial it is to stay informed and up to date yeah in today's world i feel everyone should be keep learning always because mm -hmm. in uh, in means uh, uh, specifically in the terms of technology because in the technology world it's rapidly changing so every every one week or one month you can say new technology and new things are coming up right so if you you should be keep up, updated always right so it's not uh, means uh, what we can think every every year many engineers are getting that uh, degree right so they are also learning the new technology and as we are working in the current industry we should know what new technologies are coming up right so if you know the multiple technology you can if any uh, requirement is coming so you can suggest which technology best for which project i will give you the small example if you are uh, is playing one video game there are multiple stages as you pass through the multiple stages that game will become harder and you will get the new challenges right yeah. so to tackle that challenges and you should know uh, you should know that how we can tackle that and how it will come 
once you are means you know the different technology different ways of doing it so yes. then only you can go till the last stage of that video game right so that is i can example i can link with the technology so every time you should be updated only yes yes definitely that was a great example by the way so as we come to an end do you have any advice to our audience yeah i will say to learn the new technology so that is the fourth it will start that you should be curious once if you are curious then only you will learn the new technology right yes. if you are not curious then you might not learn new technologies and you will feel that you are falling down means you are failing yes. you are going back other than others right so you should be curious always uh, don't don't uh, hesitate to ask why why the things are like there means how why and how these are the main basics that uh, which shows that you are curious right yes. Yes. so i will say you should stay always up to date as per the technology you should learn the new things you can explore the various platform which are giving the online sessions Uh, you can pass it, participate in multiple seminars currently that uh, different big companies are also having the multiple seminar means which technologies they are using so you can attend that seminar also so you will know what trend is going in current uh, currently in market yes yes right so and i can say there are uh, and uh, learning the technology is the best way it will keep you it will make you confident also and skilled also so i can say there are cloud of technologies you should learn that and sky is the only limit i can say definitely definitely shreya so as we reach the end today signifies the conclusion of our shared experience i extend my sincere gratitude to each and every one of you for participating in today's session i trust that this episode has offered valuable insights for you a heartfelt thank you goes to ashreya vinayak for joining us today thank you so much shreya Yeah thank you Tulsi let's wrap up for today and i look forward to returning with another episode next time until then stay motivated and continue learning with edureka thank you yeah, yeah. thank you bye